Well, let's make a start to the stream then. I'm giving up and getting the announcement to work. I've got a bot that's supposed to say to Discord server when the stream starts, but it's just not working as it should. Hello John Lots 3, good to see you. They're doing some D&D stuff apparently. Is that message meant for the chat or is that meant for someone else? I'm a bit confused. D&D is good though. I do enjoy D&D. Anyway, for now, let's do some Noita. The whole thing to do, we can find some weird wand combinations. Because there's a lot of fun stuff you can make for spells in this game. I want to see just how bizarre I can make it. Immediately, there's not really anything around. Is there even a way forward? Yes, I can go up here. For like, I'm not immediately stuck. Never mind, I am. That's a dead end. Well, that's a bit of a disappointing start, I guess, this way. No, that's not anything. I just got fire over here. Ooh, there is in there some extra health. I would like to get the extra health. The one below me, chest in there. That chest is certainly manageable. Bomb it. There we go. Blip all those little purple guys as well. Now let's see, what was in that chest? Acid trail. And honestly, a very, very nice wand. I'm probably going to take that. I don't see how it could go too badly. Got friendly slime creature and everything is whiskey so I'm just on fire now. How lovely. Now can I, if I drop a bomb here, get my way up to that hill? I can. It's falling down for me, saving me half the trip. And, ooh, we've also got my favourite spell fairly on. Okay, this is shaping up to be a good run. We've even got a good base one that's appeared on. Got a fair bit of money. I'd honestly be happy just going down to the Holy Mountain now. I'll have a very small explore, see if I can find anything of interest. I'd quite like to get some polymorphine or something. Just so I can easily escape from the Holy Mountain. Yeah, I need to see what's quite going on over here. Find that polymorphine, that is going to be this run pretty much sorted already. At least for early game. I mean, what I've got right now can quite easily take me through the fungal caverns. Ah, I have been given some tentacles, so I might hang back a little. Just wait for these to finish. We've been about done. There we go. Now let's see anything to pick up. I can't see any little sparkly bits. I've not got the highest of hopes ever. Got some sparkly bits there. We've got extra health. I can get to that some other way. Drop a bomb there. I want the extra health. Definitely. Let's see, can we get to this? It's a bone dust pouch. Bone dust I've never found any use for. Don't know a lot about alchemy though. Maybe it is actually useful and I'm just passing up something I should be taking. But I am just going to leave it under assumption. It's not worth having. A lot of liquids in this game don't really do much. Same with powders. 
Of course, you can like turn lab into pea soup, which is something which happened a few streams back now. That was fun. It wasn't the most useful, however. Yeah, these things are shielded. They'll take a second or two to actually kill, even if I am using fire. No, fire would work. If I can lure them into fire, they would just burn to death. Got a big flamey skull dude. They've not been much of an issue, that's fine. The Holy Mountain, where I have plenty of health. Plenty of money. Got luminous drill. I want glittering field. It's a thing which completely kills your frame rate. I'm going to say no, I'll take something with a trigger. Triggers are always nice. Faster levitation and such. No. Oh, do I take gamble? I could do gamble. What have I got? Faster ones. And bomb like spells can be used as throwables. Them? No. Actual bombs, yes. Okay. That means I don't need this wand. This wand here has just become insanely quick. Lava trail, that's quite worrying. But yeah, that's maybe a fun one to just be eviscerated and stuff with. This wand here... Does that have enough to just become a digging wand? Let's see. I'd say that works. If I take light just so I can wrap it... That's now a bit too quick. It should do the job though. Now we've got a digging wand, just two wands I don't need, and this. I'm happy to say I've got a good set of stuff. I mean, surely this can't go wrong from here, right? And all I need to do is decide, do I want to be staying here? Do I want to be going just up Void Steve's for now? I don't think that's enough to kill Steve, it's keep firing for long enough. Yeah, I'm going to avoid Steve, I think. It's a shame I can't keep the highest thing for tinkering with wands. But it will have to do, I don't really have a choice here. Can't get through that way. Little bit of a shame. Fair enough though. Do have bombs if I really need it. I usually take the bombs materialise perk. Never seen the point of having it when you can just make a wand for digging or something. I guess it could be better for aiming, because you do get a little aiming arc. It's hard to say though, if it's actually worth using in any capacity. But, what's this? Energy Orb of Timer. Better one than this one, I'll take it for now. But yet another one down there. Max health's been reduced, which is lovely. Frames aren't being too happy for whatever reason. Make my way down. I'm not going to bother using a bomb to get into there. Unless that's the way I have to go anyway. I go up. I can go up, that's fine then. Just keep on moving, get our way to Fungal Cavern and hopefully find some good spells to mess with. Oh, 
Oh, there's no one watching, which is a bit of a shame. It's not fun having completely random votes. I do enjoy having people trying to either mess with me or help me, or a mix of both. But yeah, as it is, I just need to rely on randomness going in my favour. Which, I mean, it does give me more chaos. I do enjoy chaos. Fire isn't really spreading. One's been shuffled. Wasn't the digging one, so that's fine. There we go. Got our way through. It is nice having a digging wand after the first floor. That guy down there, I don't enjoy. He seems quite worrying with that wand. That firework he's got? I want to say it's fireworks. Okay, there we go. Got rid of him. Was it fireworks? It was. Off a lot of fireworks as well. Got a charge speed. Triple spell? I can't seem to triple spell, can I? I'll also try messing with some fireworks again. I don't come across them too often. Be able to see if we can make something fun using that. Oh well. Using my digging wand as a weapon could just work out perfectly fine against these melee enemies. And that seemed to do the job there. It's certainly good. Who's I have become drunk? I mean, less aim. Is it all that bad? The digging wand potentially, but it does actually help. Having a bit of spread in the digging wand. Because it makes more of a tunnel for you. Rather than just being a straight line. I don't need to dig there, but I was just using it as a demonstration. So I will go around. It seems down is the next way to go. Ah, hello Fuke. You are telling me to hydrate. Of course, will do. I've gotten very lucky. From the first floor, look at these two wands. I've got this, and I've got this. What more could I want? I've actually got a digging wand already. Yeah, my RNG, I've gotten incredibly lucky. Also, apple and bubblegum does seem like an interesting combination. I don't know how the two flavours really combine there. I do like apple. Apple's a lovely flavour. And you've made me trip out also. Lovely. And I'll take your word for it, I don't see why you've been lying to me about any of it. Yeah, that's interesting. I wouldn't have thought it would be a great combination. Also, god, that just did a lot of damage to me. I didn't know that did so much damage, that guy. Okay. My health's just gone, apparently. Can't let them get close. They're going to freeze me if I get a chance. Need to make sure Big Tentacle Man stays away. Do I even need to go for anything in this area? I want to get the fungal shift. I think that's about it though. And I need to be incredibly careful now. Should we move cam to bottom left? You are correct, I will do that. There you go. I've also turned off the chat box in this different version. Yeah. Chat, this is basically a different 
thing from what I was using before. A different scene, I believe, I get called. So yeah, I've turned the chat off in this one as well. That's freezing vapor, isn't it? Uh, hmm. Okay, I need to be careful. Be very, very careful. It's still there. Oh yeah, I need to transition. There we go. That's off now. Keep forgetting about an extra button to press. That should be it though. Oh, this is dangerous. Why am I doing this? I've got good stuff already. Oh, I forget to transition all the time, don't you worry. Like, I barely remember to do half the stuff I meant to. I did remember to turn on the Noita point options, though, so you can drop bombs on me. As long as that did work, because things seem to be stacked against me, I'll be honest. I, I do say you can drop a bomb, please do it. Yeah, you immediately did. Of course. <laughs> oh, I shouldn't have expected anything else, should I? Well, improve once. I know I now lose all of us at once, don't I? That was polymorphin you almost dropped on me. That would have ended the run just there. Okay, apparently I ate some of it. I, I don't quite know how that happened. But now we just wait. Apparently because it was polymorph, didn't get those enemies you tried to spawn on me. Which is nice. I do enjoy not having enemies. Yeah, this tripping's can be a bit bad until I finally get the fungal shift. What's going to be fungal shift though? Ooh, that's a very nice chest. Look at all this extra health! <laughs> what on earth is that chest up to? I didn't even see what was going on. Is that multiple chests stacked on top of each other, possibly? Oh no. Uh, well, what fungal shift is you just see because there are too many little pop-ups I didn't actually make out what changed. Also I should maybe just run. That's a lot of potions. I kind of want to get the water stone though. Oh no, set myself on fire. Oh no. I think my water changed. Oh no. Well, that's unfortunate, isn't it? That was an amazing run, and I just ended myself like that. I shouldn't have gotten greedy. I wanted to get that stone, I wanted to check the bond. I shouldn't have. I should have just accepted it was fine. That's a shame. One of the best starts to run I've had in a long time, but the water did change to something, because that did not put me out. <laughs> You're immediately trying to bomb me after saying you need to tone back just how many of these things you're doing. I mean, don't blame you, it's what it's there for. If I didn't want you bombing me, I wouldn't have the votes. I also didn't have any of the point options, but I mean, I feel like keep them on regard. I mean, why wouldn't you just want to bomb me? That's a minute. I'm amazed that didn't just bite me. Any second now. There we go. It's dead. Surprisingly light body. Like, this can be kicked for miles. Hey, you didn't try to kill me. You probably hoped I'd get, like, 150 extra max health. Which 
for some reason happened to that last chest. I mean, that bomb is definitely trying to get me. I've been set on fire again. Proved one seems to be doing well. Can't get through that way, that's toxic sludge. So down this way we go. Oh, we come across nothing, it's a dead end. And you've spawned in a great treasure chest. Purifying powder. I'll take purifying powder. It's an interesting one, I don't know if I'll ever use it. But I'll take it. Yeah, great chests are somewhere between actually great or it just gives you some seeds. Yeah, I'll turn any liquid into water apart from, I believe, lava and acid. Lava just burns it, I'm pretty sure, anyway. Acid just disintegrates it. I can't say for certain, though. It might be that when I tried on the lava lake, it was just a case of the water evaporated as it was transforming. I don't actually know for that one. Go test it now, though. Yeah, I'm a little curious. Yeah, alright. I'll, I'll trust you in that. If you're saying the lava is not worth doing, you'd know a lot more about alchemy than me. What's this chest? It's chaotic polymorphine. Okay. I kinda want to pick up that other polymorphine. I'm just left on fire as well after that. Yeah, purifying it should work. There we go. And what is that? Worm blood. Okay. We've got some interesting stuff. Now, worm blood means I can go to the far left of this area, get some extra health. Just early on. The weird ones. Look at that, cast only of negative 0.3 immediately. Yeah, full regen as well. I don't know if I'll be taking that just yet, but... I just poison them or do need to fire enough to poison them? There we go. Ooh, poison doesn't get purified, it wouldn't seem. Interesting to know. Now, do I want to drop any of these? I don't think I do. I really don't think I do. That being the case, I'm just going to leave that be. I could do without the purifying powder, I guess. Nice one to have, though. Like, just in the off chance it is something you need. Yeah, I'm gonna go to the far left. I've got warm blood. If I give that a nice drink, I'll be more than happy. Can't get through that way, need to go up. Under them. Do they have any blood on them? No, they don't. Oh. Ah! Hello, Super Jesus. Yes, I've got a camera. I've invested in one. I've had it since about last week. If it stops working, do let me know because it's a very cheap one. It does seem to just stop at times. Which is not amazing, as you'd imagine. Yeah, good to see you, Super Jesus. It's been a while since you've been along. How have you been? Been up to much? Or have you just been most of relaxing? I know, at least here where I am, it's been very much warm and sunny and such. Alright, you've been doing some Genshin Impact. 
that any good? I've heard it is supposed to be good, it just doesn't seem like liking the game though. Although I could be convinced to give it a shot sometime. It was that guy just jumping into a pool of fire, I'm pretty sure. Your choice. It's a very good gacha game. Okay, is the gacha mechanic something you need to be very lucky with to do anything late game, or is it a gacha game where the gacha just gets you cosmetics and stuff for the most part? Because if that's the case, I'm fine with those kind of gacha games and loot boxes. Yeah, I know there's a lot of gacha games where it's just you need to be getting certain stuff later on, otherwise you're not going to ever progress. Get characters. Alright, this is kind of needed. I'll need to think about it then. Need to think about it. I'm not going to make any promises either way. I might look into doing a stream on it, just a one off, one time. I might not. I don't think it'd be something I'd play in my spare time, but I can say that almost for certain. And this into silver, that is such a weird thing to just shift. I don't think I've seen invisibility shift before. I've seen Berserkium shift. That's it. There goes that guy. Asked everywhere. Get a little bit of money. Honestly, I want to be making my way over there. Is it worth it? I've just been given rage. One bomb could get me really far. Let's see. How far did that bomb get? Oh yeah, that, that bomb did the job, didn't it? Uh, one thing I will say, Super Jesus, since it's also new since you last appeared, uh, I've started doing Sekiro on like Fridays through... No, Wednesdays through Fridays even. So if you're interested in that, you should come along. I'm doing fairly alright at it, I've played it before, so don't expect me to be too bad. I did not get too far in it, I don't think, when I last played it. Yeah, you might want to come along to that if it's something you'd be interested in. Again, don't feel like you have to or anything. I don't want to be strong-arming people into showing up. Oh yeah, Sekiro is great. Ah, oh, they're trying to drown me. Okay, um, that's not great. Can I actually get out still? Okay, I might be able to escape. Yeah, Sekiro is brilliant. I stopped playing it before simply because I had other stuff come up which took priority, such as university assignments and all that. Yeah, I just never managed to get back into it, so people voted for it, I've started streaming it. And yeah, I'm looking forward to at least trying to do well in it. I'd imagine there's going to be an awful lot of death, though. That's just how it goes in Sekiro, isn't it? Especially with that blazing bull thing. Like, god, that is not a fun boss to be fighting. I hate that one. Or at least hate it. Yeah, it was just around that area, if you've played the game before, that I got to when I played it before. So yeah, anything beyond that I'm unaware of, so I'm not too far through, I don't think. Uh, I'll be honest, I've never actually played a Souls-like game from, from software apart from Sekiro. I have been meaning to at some point, I've been told Dark Souls 3 is one to start off with. But... Yeah, I've done plenty of other Souls likes, like you've got Hollow Knight, you've got, like, what else is there? The Surge, 
Um, Team 17 who made the surge. I've also played their... can't remember the other name of the game, but there's another game they made. Like a fancy one with kind of like Dark Souls that's theming and such in a big castle. Lord of the Fallen. There we go. I remembered it. It's not Bloodborne. Sadly, I don't have a PS4, so I can't play any of the PS4 exclusives. Which I would like to. There's so many good PS4 exclusives. Not enough, though, to bother investing in just an entire console for it, though. Which is a bit of a shame. Although, with the like Uncharted coming over, I believe it's Uncharted 4 you said. Yeah, uh, hello, Ruri. Yeah, it was Uncharted 4 they're bringing over you said yesterday. I think it was. But yeah, there's a chance we're gonna get like lots of exclusives coming over, seeing as we've got that coming around. So that should be entertaining. Hopefully, anyway. I am wanting to try and play some of the exclusives. Oh god, no. That's not good. I've turned into giant worm. Lovely. And yeah, God of War. I, I love God of War. I knew I'd get really into that. Uh, it's officially announced, or not officially announced, but yeah, that should be good. If we get any more of their exclusives coming over, then I'm really going to be happy. Especially because imagine God of War but with RTX, because I've got an RTX card, I managed to get it second hand for the same price as a normal one. So, I mean, I thought, why not? I haven't been able to use it yet, so imagine God of War with RTX, that would be amazing. Like, that is an ideal. Is that going to ever happen? Who knows? I'm pretty doubtful, I'll be honest. Like, while I would really like it, I mean, God of War, I'd imagine, is pretty strenuous itself. The thing is, I'd like to do RTX Minecraft, but it's only the Windows 10 version. It's not the Java version, or the Bedrock version. It's bizarre, and I'm not investing £18 into a new version of Minecraft just for RTX. I might be able to get a shader of some kind, but does it? That might be worth looking into, because I know you do get fancy shaders. I just don't know if RTX is one of them. It might... My... Well, can... Okay. That is very interesting. I'll need to look into that. Because I thought I wasn't able to use Bedrock at all. If I can, that means I can get on the server my uncle got up while my cousin's in hospital. Which, I mean, isn't great. But... Oh, Windows 10 edition. Okay, so Mojang account gets you Windows 10 edition as well. If that's the case, I'm going to be doing a Minecraft RTX stream at some point. We're going to have a look at that. We do a whole series on it. Because I've been wanting to do an RTX game of some kind. I know Doom Eternal's also getting it. That's the thing. Would people want Doom Eternal? Or would they want Minecraft? It's going to be a tough choice for me, so I'm going to leave it up to everyone else because I'll likely stream it because I want my computer to die, apparently. God, yeah, that's going to really not be good for my computer, is it? My computer is going to hate me at the end of all of that. Yeah, very similar games. Very, very similar. Didn't like Doom after seeing a playthrough. That's fair enough. Doom, I'd imagine, I haven't watched much of it myself, I'd imagine it's a game better for just playing rather than watching. Like, you know those kinds of games where it's more of an experience than anything. Yeah, I don't know how that would translate. I don't know how it would. 
still though, RTX and Doom, that just sounds like a fun time to mess around with. Seen it all now, you don't... Ah, fair enough, yeah. Oh, the Doom music is nice, isn't it? Doom music's brilliant. <laughs> yeah. I mean, you're not wrong, Super Jesus. That is pretty much what Doom is, right? <laughs> Wait, the artist? I don't know much about people behind Doom. What's the artist getting up to? It's got a new noise. Heck, Gordon. Okay, I might look into that later if I remember the name, which I'll be honest, I'm not going to remember. You might need to, like, message me with that name. Also, I've been trapped in here, haven't I? Ah, was he just being a bit odd about everything? Yeah, you get some artists who need it to be their exact visions, don't you? Then again, it's not just artists who do that, it's all sorts of people. I'm not going to try and shift the blame entirely onto artists. Ah, uh, does he just think because he did the first one he had all priority in design to let anyone else get a word in? Yeah, that doesn't surprise me. I understand you need time to make like an amazing soundtrack, but to make a soundtrack you don't need too long I don't think. Right. Also, can I get the sky at all? I don't like these robots. Three months, God. No, that that sounds horrible. Like when making a game, you need that music because you need things to be fitting with the music. Yeah, that, that does not sound great. I mean, I'm not going to pretend I know everything about music, I really, really don't. Wait, what did Bethesda say? I'm curious now, you've gotten me invested. <laughs> oh god. Yeah. Yeah. That doesn't surprise me too much. They trusted him. They really shouldn't have, should they? Christ, just three to four tracks, is that all he did? Out of the entire game, that's hardly anything. There's a different track for each level, I'm fairly certain. The word sad. That means something's transformed into sand, or sand's transformed into something. Alright. So he's like trying to do multiple things at once. That's not great when some of these people involved have put a multi million dollar deal on the hold. Like, that, that does not sound like a good way to build rapport with anyone. That just seems like a way to ruin your career in making music by not being trustworthy. Well, you, you can't expect people to enjoy you when you're doing that much at once. Also, lots of fancy stuff, let's take all of it. And then be worried, because he picks up Giga Saw Blades. Anyway, what, what have we got? Accelerative homing. Concentrated light. Okay. Got a fun idea already. Let's let's try something. I've got a fun plan. This is gonna go horrifically wrong. Are you all ready? Let's go make a want. Yeah, he, he definitely does have his own like 
kind of music, doesn't he? I wouldn't say it's enough to be its own genre, but you can definitely tell it's his. You really can. That's not a bad thing, it is not... Not too bad. But he has his own kind of music, it just means... It's hard for other people to really replicate that. Anyway, fun wand. How much mana capacity? Not enough. I got a better wand for this. No. Okay, onto this wand it goes. And it seems Steve has been summoned somewhere. Where is Steve? This wand I need. Uh, we'll take extra perk, it's a really nice one early on. If he was on a wall though... Does that mean he has to be up there? I think the bricks up there, they don't count towards angering the holy mountain. Bricks down there do count. Yeah, he's in there. Gossip. Anyway, let's test this out. Okay, it fires a little bit too quickly. I've found out it doesn't quite do what I want. Um, I need to do the macro just so I can fire it once and that's it. What if I do this? Okay. How's the projectile cast a copy of itself upon expiring? Let's try this one instead. Okay, now you've actually angered Steve. That didn't even work. This one doesn't work. Why does it not work? Oh no. Yes, Super Jesus, you are a duck. I understand the quack. I, I've broken my wand I was using. Oh dear. Um, alright. I need to make my way back up somehow. That's a horrible time for Steve to appear. Oh no. Okay. Make my way back up. Can I figure out what to do? Get rid of that fair enough. To get this duck. Oh no, Steve. The duck has joined the sides of Steve, it would seem. They're working together for arguably the greater good, which is murdering me. Not the greater good for me, but in general it probably is. He seems distracted murdering some other things. Possibly the little ducks? Hard to say, I'm not going to complain. You've given me some extra healing. That is very nice to have. Sadly, I can't afford to really grab any of it just now. It will help keep me that little bit alive. Oh, Steve, no! He's fallen into the healing! How could you, Steve? He's back to full health. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. How am I still alive? I should not be staying alive this much. I'm amazed. I I'm frankly amazed. Hey, come on Steve, just die, please. Steve... I can bypass your shield for the most part because I've got chain bolt. Not enough on its own though. Okay. Managing to avoid it. We've got various ducks have just been exploded around me. It's your average Sunday afternoon, I'll be honest. Nothing too special about that. Oh, and we got Steve. Got Steve. Okay, we now need to make our way back up. 
Firstly, we need to get this healing. Healing is required. We are very low on health now. Pick this up. If we can get enough of it onto us, we can just heal entirely. Yeah, there we go. Now to go murder Super Jesus. The duck, not actually you, Super Jesus. Don't you worry. I'm not coming after you. In fact, I believe it's lost its name. It doesn't seem to be named anymore. That's alright then. I'm not actually murdering you. It's decided it doesn't want to be associated, which might honestly be a bit of an insult towards you. Dark controls, okay. It's not too bad, I'm just jumping up and down right now. I can deal with inverse controls. Okay, we've got more ducks appearing. Come on, I must be almost gone. There we go. We have murdered a large duck. It is truly to the benefit of humanity, I can assure you. Get rid of that potion because we now have a stone to get water on us. You're trying to bomb me as well. Dare you. Yeah, I need to figure out why this one doesn't work. Why does it appear back there? Yeah, Steve's up there as well. I was wondering why we had the music. Uh, what if we do this? Does Chain Bolt just go on forever? It does. I'm half tempted to do that. <laughs> Can I just have infinite Chain Bolt? I'm really tempted. Uh, if, yeah, if you turn your Twitch back on, you can also get votes, don't worry. If that's something you decide you want to have, I'll be a bit confused, but I'm not going to stop you. And yeah, you should have the drops. You can bomb yourself if you really want. That was a mimic you gave me. Don't appreciate that one. Tense Concentrated Light looks very fancy, doesn't it? Never knew quite how fancy this spell was. Well. Didn't do much in the way of digging. You know what? It looks like it should, though. Ah, oh, did yours not work? That is a shame. Uh, yes, you just have the uh, Twitch Extended enabled. And you're on full vanilla. Damn. You aren't able to cheat. Can't believe it. You can still have votes on, though. You can have votes on and vote for your own run if you're definitely wanting to cheat. It'd be a bit peculiar for me, not knowing at all what's going on. Yeah, eventually I'll kill you, but you could turn your frequency to be lower than mine. Come on, there we go. Murdered all of them. I am enjoying this concentrated light. Like, this just looks fun. Now, here's a question. I've got worm blood. Do I go to the magic temple? Do I get myself some omega spells? It's just too early for omega spells. It might be too early, you know. Although, the boss there, they put up a shield after getting shot. 
Yeah, their shield isn't up before getting shot with you. Like, I've got a big hitting spell here. I might be able to take them down. Should I risk it? He has a lot of health and he hits rather hard. I might avoid it. I might avoid it, yeah. I don't need Omega spells, not just yet. Or the Greek lesser spells of whatever kind they are. And is this the entrance to the Magic Temple? Yes, it is. To be staying away. I do want to just laser beam a few things. Like, that's always fun. Only 52 damage there. I just thought that would do more. One of the best things though about concentrated light is it just eviscerates corpses, there is no corpse left behind. Which is very nice not leaving a mess behind you. Like recycling, but without any of the recycling part you're just murdering things. It's nothing like recycling when you get down to it. It's just like recycling, I promise. Ooh, and we have healing ghosts. Super Jesus, you've made a reappearance. This time as like a slimer looking thing. Cannibalism isn't recycling, it's reusing, possibly. Is, is it reusing? It's definitely not recycling. It's you're not turning it into anything new now that it's gone. I don't know what it would be. I could argue that's composting it. Composting it is definitely true. Because, yeah, like you say, you do process it in your body, turn it into this just natural waste that will decompose even better. Why am I discussing this? This is a weird topic for you. Why do you bring this up? <laughs> oh, you almost went into a new game. I can't believe it. My plans failed. This is all I wanted. I just wanted to ruin your run without even trying. Some guy down there. Got a sniper. Can I get the sniper? Can't tell quite where they are. And I'm currently drunk, so I can't aim. I could just use my massive chain bolts. Where are they? I can find them with the chain bolt. It goes on forever. We've got extra health, I think I might just make my way down from here. Nothing all that exciting in frozen caverns. I'm curious what sand turned into, but I might make my way up at some point. Anyway, avoid the health, we don't need it just at the moment. I found something fun and fairly broken, do I take it? I've done it before is the only thing. I've got accelerative homing. I've got plasma cross. Do I? Oh no, I've been given projectile attraction. Oh no. Oh no. I am not lucky for you. I'm anything but I need to last 30 seconds while attracting all of this. And yes, the fish have been murdered. I couldn't have saved them from Steve's wrath. Clearly the fish were to blame for all of us. Did manage to kick a statue into them. Thankfully, I didn't die, even with projectile attraction going on. 
Yeah, I can't say no. I love the combination I can get from this. Give me just a second to make a fun wand. I'll save a couple of them just in case. I can't make a flight wand of these. Yeah, take this. Question is, how much do I put into a wand for it? These are cheap, 80 mana, for what is going to be utterly, utterly mad damage. Keep a few of these. I don't need the rest, I can just bin the rest of these. Okay, so, what I'm about to do, I'll lay it out so people can see what's going to be going on. I have Spark Bolt of Trigger. I also have several plasma crosses, don't know if I'm going to be using all of them at the same time. Add this into here. All of these home in onto enemies and they last a long time. Each of these four plasma beams doing an awful lot of damage. Question is though, can I get a wand with enough mana capacity? If I can, and I'm definitely about to win this. Because accelerative homing is not the ideal homing for this. It's gonna take an awful lot of mana. This is going to be in total 150 mana. 150 mana. Can I justify 150 mana? I can on this. Oh god, Bob curse. Okay. Let me just sit up here for a moment. We should all fall down. Okay, the ground's disappeared. Okay, just keep on moving. It's all fine. And they've stopped. I'm a tad on fire, but I still have the healing ghosts, so that's fine. But yeah, one of these ones might work better. This one has always cast of extra damage. Sadly, I don't think I can justify using that. Okay. Okay, I can put it on this one. Really low recharge time. Potentially this one that hasn't always cast. This one's not great. Alright, we're just going on to this one. How do I... How do I change things? I need to keep a lot of these spells. I don't need energy sphere. I don't need normal spark bolt. I want to keep them. Sadly, for now, all I can do is the one plasma beam cross. On a wand that fires, frankly, far too fast, it's not going to be ideal for this. I mean, it will do its job, like, look at that. They're all going to home in on someone. However, after that, nothing happens. So if I get stuck, I need to wait, and then I can fire again. It should work. It should work. Anyway, let's see what we get. Oh, oh yeah, I've managed to just one-shot the dragon with this before. Well, I think I stuck extra damage. All I had is bloodlust. The extra lots of damage, let me check quickly. Uh, yeah, Bloodlust, this one. 33 extra damage on it. I don't know if it actually did anything. But yeah, this is a powerful wand I've got. What do I want? Projectile slower? Maybe, maybe, I don't think so. Repulsion sector, I do like repulsion sector. I know it's arguably not the best wand ever, but I do enjoy it. Yeah, anyway, let's escape for now. I just sit on this ledge, I won't activate the Holy Mountain. The Holy Mountain, I believe, triggers there. Yeah, down I go, and I'll show you what this does, because you can see there's something down there. There is no longer something down there. It digs through walls, as long as the material is relatively soft. Like, things are going to be dying. Six 
sellers of homing, it's going to be moving very fast towards things. And I believe it homes from any distance away. Yes, it just murdered them. This is going to be dangerous. If I misfire it, because of a fire rate, all of them will end up hitting me pretty much simultaneously. I need more health so I don't kill myself, because this is going to melt through anything it touches. Can I afford to be melting through everything I touch, including myself? Oh, I very much almost misfired it there. But yeah, with seeing how fast it just kills things, I have to take it. It's a bad idea. I'm going to get myself killed. I'm not prepared for it just yet. Seller to homing, this thing's just going to go utterly mad. I need to try though. Can't pass it up, it's two one of ones. Like look at that, that was two hundred damage and maybe a quarter of a second, if that. How can I pass that up? I just I have to take it. I'm gonna make my way down to the dragon, I think. I need the extra health on the way if I can find it. Okay. Okay. That's an always cast, that's going to apply to the first projectile. This isn't ideal for this spell combination. What that would do is make the spark bolt of trigger deal more damage. This one wouldn't. I don't think that's what I need. However, it's a very nice always cast. I do think I take over this. Oh yeah, Invis Perk's amazing. Like, people don't give it enough love, I feel. Also, I really need to escape them. There we go. I've escaped them. They're all dead. Delayed spell cast. It could work. It could. I think what I need more is reduced spread, because that's extra damage to all of your projectiles, regardless of where they cast. So I'd just be dealing so much more damage from Plasma Cross. Yeah, but spawning it farther away isn't necessarily what I want. I've got the trigger on it, simply so I can land on people. I land on top of someone, that's fine. But yeah, with homing, I need it to land next to someone. If I cast it and it homes in my direction, that's me dead. I can't be casting this anywhere near where I am. Because, see the enemy over there? It should home in towards someone in that direction. It didn't home in towards that one with the blue light, though. It's not predictable. I don't enjoy homing because there's too many things that can end up going wrong. Yeah, let's just be a bit speedier, I think. Because I dealt a fair bit of damage to myself, but that one spell volley just murdered five different people. All of which were not in my line of sight. What this? Honestly, I could take this. I wouldn't murder five people, regardless of what some might say, myself included. I wouldn't do such a thing. Yeah, this repulsion sector I've got, it's just occurred to me. That might actually be more useful than I thought. Because potentially, I can push away the plasma beam crosses if I miss them. It's not going to be pushing them far. But it is a projectile, like if I fire it there, that bit in the middle, you can see there's a very small blue projectile. That gets affected by like projectile gravity and such, it will mean, rather than being stationary, it will start to fall down, and stuff like that. 
This projectile doesn't do damage itself, it's a bit like the Dark Flame one, if you know how that one works. I could push it away, if need be. Also, Steve, I'm sorry, you're just going to die. That didn't home in on him. Okay. Did that one home in? Yeah, that one homed in. There goes Steve. <laughs> He's still slowly dying, apparently, with all that bone dust falling in. Okay, we have in there... Eat your vegetables, personal plasma beam... We have the big orbital laser beam. Tempting to take that. I currently don't have any way to dig. That would be my way up. Oh, and have you just murdered yourself again? Poor Fuke. Yeah, this one here, it fires much slower. That's actually ideal. I don't want to be firing all my plasma death crosses at once. Got one quad cast. Don't know if I want to be using that over triple spell. Like, cost an extra three mana, I never noticed. But yeah. If I now move things onto here, this 10 plus 60 plus 80. Alright, that's 150. It gets that back in a second. Want to check what that actually looks like. It homed in the ducks, I almost murdered myself. Oh no. Okay. Uh, mana comes back nice and quickly. I can fire just faster than it comes back. Now the question comes in with chain spell. So I want to see how this works. Oh. Um, I don't like how jittery that is. Oh, that is a weird one. That continues to home in then that eviscerates any boss. Okay, let's see. First one homes in. Then it doesn't home in. Okay, I don't end up using this then. That's not something I want to use. That's more things I can run into. Secondly, ducks. I mean, I've got to see. And also, that's a lot of gold you've just given me. Yeah, it's just a duck now. That's fine. Thirdly, do I want to add in all my plasma crosses? Look at that damage. Look at this damage output. And for that mana cost, it costs, like, barely anything. That was 150 minus 10, so 140, plus an extra 160. That's 300 mana, and you get utter madness in these numbers. It does seem they've stopped wanting to home in. Have I broken something? You know what, I'm just going to trust it. I, I think it's fine. Now, annoyingly, my rule is when chat gives me a wand, I have to carry it until I'm given a new wand. So, I guess goodbye to that wand, and we now have to take this, which I'm sure everyone can agree is not really a abysmal wand. Yeah, let's continue on our way down. How long do people think the dragon's going to last? I could actually run a pole, couldn't I? I could see how that works. I don't think I've run a pole before. Also, I do think I will take this stone. Purifying powder, it's been good having you. Wait. Did ducks die from running? What on earth is this stone? <laughs> I know what it does, but why is it murdering the ducks before we even do anything? That's one deadly stone. Maybe I should kick it at an enemy. That couldn't possibly go wrong for me. Yeah, that, that stone's going to be my way up. That's brilliant. Rage of the Gods in the rock form. I mean, arguably, yes. Lava Pit, that's fine enough. I was currently flying. 
Yeah, I want to make way down to the dragon, so go down in that kind of a direction. However, I also want to be being very careful, because any misfire of this wand now is me guaranteed to die. I mean, while that sounds entertaining, uh, sadly, it's not quite so entertaining for me, because I've got myself a very fun wand now. I don't appreciate you dropping enemies on me, Fuke. They spawn in a very close range. That could go incredibly wrong if you did that just a moment in firing or something. They will be the thing that my thing homes in on. Oh, you've given the new wand. Yeah, I need to carry whatever wand they give me. I'll be honest, what on earth is this wand? <laughs> Look at that mana charge speed. That's... That's bizarre. My other rule, though, is I'm not allowed to edit the wand. So what the earth's this going to do? I churn sludged enemies, and just any kind of weird stuff can happen because it's a shuffled wand. Well, I mean, look at that mana charge speed. <laughs> That's exactly what I need for Energy Sphere. Such an intensive spell. <laughs> oh god. What are the chances of actually getting a good spell though on it? Oh, frames are not happy for that moment. Money to be had up here though. Now one thing I might want to consider. Now, uh, you know what, I'm going to say yes, you can give permission to change the wand. I might make that like one of the point of redemption things. It's not like an integrated thing, but I might say you need to use points because it can very much break a wand and it would just have fat chiting over, or yeah, it would have chat fighting over what wand I'm using from then. Yeah. Uh, as I was saying, one thing I might want to consider is go to progress quickly. Um, where is it? It's plasma cross and such. Ah, up here. Okay, plasma beam. Arguably, less damaging than plasma cross because this homes in all four beams are on the enemy. That's where it gets its damage. However, if I misfire plasma beam. So less likely to murder me. Now another thing, which we might want to consider, is plasma cutter. It's less likely to immediately murder me. Oh, thank you for the follow, by the way. Very much appreciated. Yeah, plasma cutter less likely to end up hitting me. If it does, I definitely die, and it can cut through metal, as well as pretty much any other material that exists in this game. I get that, I'm gonna have to do it. I mean, I have to see how it goes. I've never gotten it with proper homing. I've got rotate towards full before, I believe. I had what was essentially sentry that just lasered any enemy it landed next to. And I believe... Yeah, what I've also got before... Did the wand spawn in, or did it knock us in a menu? I'm going to go check quickly. Was there a wand over here? It did spawn in. Uh, is this the wand? It is. Alright. Okay. Arguably, it's more useful. It's a lot more consistent in what it does. I do like magic arrows. They can let you fly. If I had enough fire speed, it would work a lot better, but it'll certainly do the job. Anyway, let's go murder the dragon. Going down isn't really needed, actually. I think I just need to go across from here. The floors aren't very deep. You do need to keep that in mind. And yeah, you do just have to go across. Say a chest to be nice. I can assure you right now, this is a mimic. 
Knockback and spells really does knock people back, though, doesn't it? I've never tried that one before. Yeah, you've given a new wand. You're really fighting over the wands, and now you've given me ridiculous max mana, no mana charge speed, and giga disc projectiles. <laughs> oh no. I mean, different viewers doesn't matter, it's Twitch chat. I know I do take it. Say fire it, okay. Okay, I've got repulsion sector, I can avoid it if I need to. Doesn't fire too quickly. It's still way too chaotic to predict. Anyway, let's let's check quickly. How do you do pull? I know you're able to do run pulls. Uh, okay, let's see. Uh, how fast does Dragon die? I'm gonna say... 1 second or 0 0.1 second. <laughs> I want you to place your bets. Uh, you can vote as many times as you want. Uh, Unless, is that, is that not what I want? Is this not a poll? Uh, no, is it, is it a... What things can I do? What am I looking for? I would have thought it would be polls. Ah, prediction. I figured it out. I found what I need. Okay. Let's do, as I said, for one second, you get point 0.1 second. Got 30 seconds to take your vote. Let's, let's do the prediction. How does this work? <laughs> I think it's up top of the chat if you want to have a look. You can win channel points, apparently. Now apparently everyone's thinking it's going to be 0 0.1 seconds. <laughs> Honestly, I don't blame any of you. Oh, never mind. Someone's thinking it's going to take one second. Alright, we've got a bit of a split here. Well, let's see then. Oh, and you've done everything while I was paused. There goes the duck. I feel bad for the duck, it just got eviscerated. I didn't even know it was spawning in. Oh god. Yeah, you're just spawning everything. Oh no. Yeah, we need to make our way inside. Can we get far enough down all that easily? Because I might end up murdering the Fuke homunculus, I'm going to be honest. Ooh, I almost murdered myself. Yeah, this is why I need to be careful here. I really need a better way to do my digging. There's a dragon. That wasn't quite 0.1 seconds. It wasn't entirely eviscerated, was it? What what would I say there? Honestly, that, that's got to be 0.1 second. It definitely was not a second, was it? It wasn't a second. How'd I end the poll? I don't know. Uh, how, how'd I fix... How'd I end the poll? Or prediction? Um, what do I have to do? Slash prediction again? I'm not used to channel points and such yet. Ah, I figured it out. There you go. 0.1 seconds won. It definitely was not an entire second there, was it? It definitely was not. But yeah, I'm very much almost dead here. Oh no. Oh, was, was there a wand somewhere? Ah yes, there is. Well, rules are rules. Uh, no, this was from the dragon, wasn't it? We don't need this wand. 
But this one's not very good. I'm gonna leave it. You say it's amazing, is it really? Like, 300 mana charge speed, yes it's nice, but that recharge time... That recharge time is a major flaw there. You don't want to be waiting two seconds. I mean, I've got two reduced recharge times, that could take it down to being one second, but still, that's that's not great. If you have high charge speed, then you need to have a fast, like, cast time. You can just be spamming out the same one or two spells over and over again. And that one does not what we're needing. Also, we do have healing go, so I should let them heal me for a second. I like how stream elements became one, rather than Fuke, because Fuke, you don't deserve it, you tried to murder me while I was setting up a prediction. Also, how do prediction rewards work? I don't actually know. Because there's only two of you in it, did, like, one of you get all the points? Like, how does it work? Like, what I think works is like it's split between the winning prediction for like the total amount put in but yeah it would be you getting all of theirs wouldn't it as well i could throw the prediction just to give people points if i'm able to vote on my own also there goes steve who would have guessed <laughs> i feel bad for steve he doesn't deserve this I mean, he does somewhat. He is just trying to do his job, but his job is murdering me. Yeah, I really need a way to dig. Damn. Ooh, you've given me slow mo a clip. It took 0.7 seconds. Ooh, I should have given that to the other side then. If that was closer to one second, I. Ooh, I feel bad there. I am sorry, if I could give you your points back, I would. Oh, the gods are very angry. Okay. I mean, I believe if I've done something wrong, I mean, Titanic could be fitting, wouldn't it? And actually, you just want other ones. That's also fair enough. This is the worst place for a one to spawn. Oh god. Uh, can I even pick up this last perk? I think I can still. Rats everywhere, that's fine. Also, I've just noticed. Fuke, your homunculus is carrying a previous chat wand. Yeah, do I want extra health? It's an extra 50%, that's 140 more health. I was saying I need more health. Is it worth using an entire perk for at this stage? No, I think I need to get an immunity or something. That was not an immunity. Okay. Don't have enough to do it again. I guess extra life? Extra life's a fun one. Saving grace stops you getting one shot, but the thing is, if I'm dying from my own wand, then I'm going to be getting hit multiple times for very small amounts of damage. Yeah, I understand that one health. Not gonna do the job. I think I'm gonna have to take extra life. I should have gone with extra health to begin with. Anyway, let's polymorph. I won't homunculus shoots me because it's a chaotic polymorph. Got to keep that in mind. I don't want you murdering me, Fuke. And apparently, I didn't move enough. We collapsed it anyway. That's a shame. Well, you've seen something, Fuke. You can do it. Did they patch the ledge? I mean, I'll take your word for it. I've managed to abuse it before, though. Like, earlier in this stream. 
Also, that's a lot of oil. I do forget things drop their oil based on how many times they're hit. Also, I'm about to get caught in fire if I'm not extremely careful. Yeah, few, you are slowly burning to death in an oil fire. I would offer to put you out with some water, but... I mean, luckily Noita doesn't actually have that simulator, so I'm able to put you out with water. But normally that would not go well. Like, do not put water on oil fires. For the love of God, it's a bad idea, don't ever do it. Ooh, just took just shy of 100 damage because I misfired my one slightly. I think there's a way to get infinite HP. No, Fuke, you're murdering yourself, stay away! Yeah, I think... I don't know if they fixed it, there was a way to... It wasn't infinite, but you broke the health calculations. So it gave you the max amount of health you could possibly have. It was using those mages that reduce your health. Oh, there is a way to literally get infinite health. Okay. Is that the one I mentioned, or is that close to infinite? Because you just get so much. Also, electric arc. Do I want that? Ah, the second one with the quote unquote infinite health. What's wrong with it? It doesn't have an official way to obtain. Alright. So, my way is the only way you can actually get in a game. Good to know I'm not mistaken, at the very least. Now, Electric Arc... You, oh, you scattered all my goals. Oh no. Uh, I was about to spend all of that. Well, guess I'm not spending my money just yet, then. I was going to say Electric Arc would stun enemies, even if they do survive, they will then not be able to escape. Uh, okay, uh, what did you say in the chat? Cause you're, you're saying stuff in there. Um, I mean, solve the chest after the end of everything. I'm, I'm gonna just leave you to discuss it if you, you know a lot more about like the more secret stuff in this game. I most try, try and learn it for myself. I do let people tell me what's going on. Get 35 and 36 orbs. That's a lot of orbs. That's an awful lot. I'm understanding, orbs are a lot more powerful than I thought. I mean, with the wand I've got now, we could try and make us a proper run, like, see where we can get with it all. It is going well. Five and Okay. I'm just gonna pretend I know what you're both on about. <laughs> I really don't have a clue though. Also, there's a wand up there. Did I check that? I think I did. I could do an 11 orb run. That is certainly something I'd be willing to try. I mean, I'm assuming you mean 11 of the normal orbs, not cursed orbs, because that'd be a fair bit easier. I believe there's an 11 normal ones. I do think I know where they all are. There's one I haven't actually picked up yet. Oh. Yeah, you know what? That could be my next goal. So my goal previously was getting to the moon. And then eating it. But I've already done that now. Trying to solve the eye puzzle. Eye puzzle's a weird one, yeah. I 
don't quite know everything about it. I do know the eye puzzle, it does involve you tripping out massively, if it's the one I'm thinking about anyway. It's a puzzle that very much intrigues me. Encrypted message. Ah. Alright, that would that would make more sense than what I was thinking. And like I say, I don't know a lot about the lore and such in this game. I just like messing with wands. Two months. So I'm assuming then it's a rather complicated cipher reviews. It's not just gonna be your simple like, substitution cipher or something like that, which I imagine a lot of devs would use. Now one thing to keep in mind is, while the game is in English, it was made in another language. Like, all the enemies, is it Swedish or Norwegian or something? Finnish, there we go. I'm assuming whatever you cipher is going to be in Finnish. Unless, could it be like, older Finnish language or something like that, because I know there's a lot of dialects in the world which have words which don't appear outside of that dialect and it's not an official word. There's plenty of Scottish words can see off the top of my head just from around Dundee, where I am. But none of them exist in the dictionary, I wouldn't think. Ah, they alternate then. Ah, yeah. Oh god, yep. Yeah. That does not sound like a fun time. I do not envy for trying to figure it out. But well done on giving it a shot. I know I shouldn't have been bothered with it myself. I just have Plasma Cutter. I take Plasma Cutter. I think I do, you know. But yeah, we have Mega Steve, so I'll just get rid of him quickly. There goes Mega Steve. Yeah, his gold's been chucked around a little. We managed to get some of it. Let's hope we don't suffocate. Oh no. Uh, okay, I can use this to get out. That does do explosions. It's for Steve's name is literally Cop. He is... Okay. So he's just the police there, apparently. I was not expecting that. I was not expecting that at all. Also, I think I do take Plasma Cutter. I've only got the one Plasma Cutter, though. So I need to say, that's 20 damage. This is 20 damage still. But it cuts through all materials, and it only goes in one direction. I fire this off. Is that plasma cutter actually doing anything? It does. It doesn't last as long though. Okay, I might stick with these then. At the very least, I have electric arc. Yeah, I will be facing away from the trigger. You are correct about that. It does have homing, but it would aim towards the enemy. Yeah, what I should try... Give me a portal, I may need to go through that. I need to quickly pick up a perk then. Give me just a moment. Uh, what perks? Uh, concentrated spells, it's extra damage. Might as well. Come on, we can't let the portal disappear. Come on, portal. We are... Back in the coal mines. Alright, I guess we're just going up then. Are we able to edit our ones in there still? Yes, we are. Now... We can look for health down here. 
do we want to just look for basic hearts? I don't think we do. I think we go get orbs. I make my way down. I believe I can still edit my ones. Like, below here is where we spawned in the Mighty Duck, I think. They okay, spawned in Mighty Duck. That's where we angered Steve. I had to bite off both of them. Somehow managed to survive. So I make my way down. I edit my ones. I can use Plasma Cutter. That will dig through, I believe, any materials. Much like how Luminous Drill does, it's just more dangerous to you. You've improved my wands. Okay. That, that's an interesting thing. Also, I've just noticed I should take off the whole lightning part to my wand, shouldn't I? Chaining lightning between my spells it sounds fun stunning enemies, but I'm going to end up electrocuting myself without proper perks. Take that one off. Add that one in. That could be a fun time. Do I want to do this? I'll be honest, not really. That, that's gonna go badly, isn't it? I'll take that one off, I think. Yeah, we need to make a wand for plasma cutter. Do we have anything that's nice and fast with good mana charge speed? Got this. This one could work. Work better than this? Yes, it does. Add a duck on to make it cheaper. It costs 30 mana. Wait a second. I can launch a plasma cutter beams. This is so much safer. Oh, repulsion sector is coming in clutch. It lets me actually dig now. Look at that. It's not even half bad at digging. Isn't that lovely? Well, time to go collect some orbs. Orb room boss. Do I go up there? I believe last time I went up there with a powerful run, Orb room boss polymorphed me and then I just died. I'm assuming you've just died right a second, if you. Yeah, I damaged myself. I need to get health health back up here. <laughs> yeah, that, that's the kind of relationship everyone has if not, I'm fairly certain. And yeah, there isn't health there and I shouldn't have done that while firing while I was running. Yeah, down here I go. Careful, I will accidentally be killing myself for not. Stop a health refresh in the. Yes, I was going to say little area left, the topmost place. We do, in fact, still have the health top up in there. That's a thing that still exists. Picks up the extra max health, so I can get health from up there. Lava, I can cross without any flight. I have the stone. That's not hella loot. That was a mimic. You lied. Not on purpose, mind you. Purpose. Yeah, I am getting a bit low on health. I'm not being careful enough. Yeah, as I say that, I get shot by myself yet again. I'm going to be playing this game a lot more reservedly. Can't be running into things all the time. My own spells, as I said earlier, are the thing that's going to kill me in the end. Okay, now this time, this one is loot. Is that molten metal in the worm blood? Alright. Sure. I'm not gonna question that. It's 
spear combinations get out of the chest, but like I say, not going to question it. That's perfectly fine. We've made our way to here. I believe these do have recoil to them. I will check. I do think that knocks me back slightly when I fire it. Could make a flight wand if I use these just right. Flight wand's not really required just yet, but I could. What I do need to do is go up this wall and fly over to the other side. As I do that, I can start picking up some orbs. I should leave the orb room boss until I've at least got full health. Or close to full health if I do end up losing a bit. But let's see, am I still good at predicting where the... Is that a hole in the wall? That's a hole in the wall, isn't it? Why is there water? Why is there... A gap. I'm curious. A go kart. I'll be honest, I've got no idea what you're on about, so I'm curious. I'm really curious. It's down there. Yeah, I've not seen the go kart. I don't know anything about a lot of the secrets in this game. Where is it? <laughs> what? What is this? Okay, yeah, I, I see how this works. It follows your cursor and it moves. Okay. Okay, this is going to be a fun time, isn't it? Not even working now. Ah, it follows based on my position. Okay, got it. Oh yeah, but this is a fun time. <laughs> this is a fun little thing to play with, isn't it? I'm terrible at it, but it's fun. I mean, I could just go down here. This isn't a full lap though, is it? That doesn't count. I need to go all the way through. This is hard to control because it doesn't go based on my position. Well, let's bring it with us. <laughs> Come on. Got a pet. Will it stay with us for long? Probably not, I'll be honest. Still fun to have around though. Yeah, off it goes. Ooh, and always cast. I believe that was to this and that is the crits. Crits will do the job. Anyway, we want to be going in around here, I believe. Myself a little gap. And here we are. We made our way through. Lovely. I'm still good at predicting this. I have learnt from last time you can take form without picking up the thing inside before. That that's good. But we're just gonna lose this school cart thing, aren't we? Well, I guess we're not going back to that later, are we? Unless we're going to somehow get it back. Have you ever looked up the real Emerald Tablet? I have not. Most of the time, as I've said before, I don't look into things about this game. I like to try and learn them for myself or have chat, like, telling me what's going on. I do apologise for mildly murdering you there. 
Anyway, across the lava lake we go. Has nothing to do with noise. Is it just an actual emerald tablet in the world? All right, that's an interesting thing. Also, that this feels really risky. I'm not enjoying this. I know for the most part I'm safe, but that that does not feel good to do. Okay, that sounds interesting. Just alchemy, Jesus. This is Jesus, but he's completely high on various alchemical fumes. Like, what more could you want? It would seem that the Farland Griffinus has left this point. It's a bit of a shame. Yeah, it's good having another person around to chat. I'm just stuck with you, Fuke. can't believe it. I mean, you say it's torture, it can't be that bad, your wife puts up with you. Or maybe she doesn't. I don't know, I'm just assuming she puts up with you there. <laughs> yeah, that's just marriage. I mean, I say that, I've got no experience in marriage, I'm just assuming you're correct. <laughs> you should be cutting the lawn, but instead, you want to, for some reason, watch me. I still don't understand. I don't get how I'm all that entertaining. I'm not complaining. If people find me fun to watch, I'm not going to stop anyone. So the accent, is that all it is? I mean, I'll be honest, not got much else going for me. I'm not the worst to look at, I don't think, but I could certainly be a lot better. I don't put a lot of effort in. <laughs> I talk funny and I play noita. I mean, that's not a very big criteria to me. Oh, I've just murdered you, Fuke, I do apologise. Treasure vein. Lovely. They're sub to two streamers. God, I'm one of them. Oh no. I mean, I'm not gonna say you should be spending your money better, but I mean, you're just sub to two people and I'm one of them. You've got so many better choices out there. I'm sorry to tell you, but you might have made the wrong one. I mean, yeah, fair enough. Speaking to people is certainly one of the main reasons I like Twitch. Also, can I evaporate the water? I can. Let's just evaporate all the water. I think this is the safest way to be going through this area. How does plasma beam evaporate? Yes, it does. Lovely. I can just fire that in there and it's perfectly good. I do appreciate hearing a, a good conversation. I mean, what one thing are you on about? There's nothing I do wrong with you. And yes, I am aware, all this condensation, I did miss it partly. And I've got acid, not acid, poison everywhere. Yeah, I might wait a moment. Ah, the window, yeah, I can. Give me a second, I'll wait. For... But no, I can just close my curtains. There you go, it's complete darkness. You cannot see anything. <laughs> yeah, no, that, that's not gonna work, is it? That's a bad idea. Open up the curtains again, let's use my blinds. And I've got caught in something. There we go. Is this better? That should hopefully fix any problem you had. We want to be going down here. The cat, it is currently outside because the weather is nice. 
is sitting underneath a bush. I could get your picture later if you want. Yeah, I want my cats outside. They like going outside. I'm drowning. Well, polymorphs I can escape. <laughs> I'm still drowning. Okay. Okay. This is a bad idea. I'm escaping. The health's down there. I've spotted it. I have seen the thing I want. Now I just need to try and get it. Healing Ghost happened while I was... I mean... I want to say... Trying not to drown. I wasn't doing my best at not drowning though. <laughs> oh, lovely. Maybe you're just going to cover up my face, are you? I mean, if you have enough points, you can mess with my cam. I could change it so it's monochrome or something if you want. Or make it extremely dark. Like, just a thousand channel points, you can completely ruin the stream for everyone else. Not a lot to ask for, I'll be honest. I maybe should put the cost of the mess of webcam up a bit. Healthy rain. Okay, it's mostly in a wall. And I've I need to run away from it because lightning cloud. Drink that. Uh, I would have, but it immediately smashed. Sadly, I had to just be in us instead. Is that up there, I'd imagine? No? I don't know where I am. That guy is not happy that I'm here, though. I, I do forget just how viciously my projectile goes towards people at times. I do really, really enjoy just how quick it gets. <laughs> just... They run away. Also, what's this? Why are there statues? I'm confused. I'm gonna ignore it. That's that guy up there gone. You said you're a bush. I think I spotted you in time to murder you. I didn't even notice you spawned in. Look at those pro gamer reflexes. Easy rain, oh no. No, that's actually a bad one because it's going to be going haywire with the homing. Run away and hope it doesn't go too wrong. Okay, I think that went okay. And you're back to dropping bombs and making various puns of the name. Where on earth does it teleport to, by the way? I think I found my way back. <laughs> it took a while. Uh, we had, yeah, healings down here. I went really far with that teleportium. Or unstable teleportium. I didn't need to pick that up, actually. I'm an idiot, haven't I? Well. I mean, it was my goal coming here for that. So I thought, oh yeah, I need to pick it up. I was on full health. God. If you don't come here for quality pro gamer moves, then I don't know what you do come here for. I mean, apparently the funny accent, according to Fuke. But apart from those two things, I mean, there isn't anything else going on. No, there is actually a cat occasionally. There is a cat. You could be coming for that. That's quite a few things you could be coming for. I'm, I'm hoping you're all having fun though. I mean, you do seem to reappear. Well. Heck no. Can't say that. You've seen the pictures we've exchanged, Fuke. You can't say anything. Anything implies an awful lot. Do you? Do you really, Fuke? Did you go that... Did you go that far? I'm gonna need to check that later. 
Okay, thank God you don't. All you have is a helicopter dating sim, which I gave you as a birthday present. Have you played any of that yet, or is it just sitting around? <laughs> I mean, helicopter dating sim. I managed to find some fun games to give people. I do try my best to find just the bizarre anime dating sims. Ah, shower of your dad, son. A game I don't understand. Oh, and we've got Berserk him. I could give that a drink. I'll do my best. I apparently ate something I shouldn't have. Oh dear. I'm slowly dying. That rotten meat. Yeah. Well, I've got two immediate choices. One, I'm sensible and dig up. Use this one. Two, I use this giant laser beam. I'm going to say I'd be sensible, although I could be outvoted. <laughs> Imagine wasting it just to get up here. How many people would that annoy? I would love to do that so badly. <laughs> They've got no idea how tempting it is. Okay, I need this orb from up top. I just need to dig in. Just gonna chuck this on the ground, is my idea. Of course, I'm not going to actually do it, Fuke, but. I mean, it is very tempting to. Can't deny the fact it is tempting to disappoint you. And what have you done? Sands of Time. Ooh, and various things which I believe are based on which level I'm currently at. Those enemies luckily weren't too difficult. Although, out of curiosity, I'd imagine it changes depending on the, like, biome thing? Uh, it doesn't say biome down there. I swear it used to. Does that mean if I go to pyramid it'll change? If I go into the desert it'll change? Imagine in the desert... Uh, oh, fish. You're doing okay. Are you getting pushed by my projectile repulsion or are you running away? I don't know. You can spawn powerful ones at the pyramid. Alright. That plasma beam goes out really far actually. I was just using that to mess with the fish, but look how far that went. Have I ever done... what have I ever done? Crystal key? No! I started with that, but then I died to something. I can't remember what. Ah, I remember now. It was polymorphine I died to. I wasn't entirely sure where the crystal key was and everyone else had left for day. Yeah, I will do a crystal key then while I'm doing all of this. Seeing as I will be going past it, because I need to get the alchemist boss anyway. Anyway, here we are, in the desert. The air is hot, as you'd imagine. Does that mean you evaporate your clothes quicker? I think it does. No. Seems about normal. Must just be actual liquids. The yeah, air is hot is an annoying one. Also, more bombs. I mean, yeah. The best way to do it is with the Sea of Something spell. Sea of Something will just completely fill it in one go. That's what you do. Apart from that, it's almost impossible. Like, I cannot think of a reasonable way to fill it. Have you never used the Sea of Something spell? I mean, I haven't either, but... Yeah, it's probably what you'd want to do. It's the only real use I can think of for the Sea of Anything spell. Unless it's Sea of Lava, in which case you can just use it to murder some enemies. And yourself later on if you're not careful. 
see a flammable gas though. That'd be a weird one. Ah yeah, water trail could do it. Water trail certainly could. I don't think I've got water trail. Why am I on fire? What a pot that exploders. Anyway, take that, we're gonna go into boss. When I say into boss, we're just gonna dig through as well. Right. Yeah, I'm only coming here for the orb is pretty much the reason. I come here to defeat this boss because it gives you a bit extra health, gives you a wand which can have fun spells on it. Sadly, they took away the better spells he gave you. It used to give you the extra triggers, I believe. At least for a short while. Before that, he also gave you some, I believe... Is it the Greek letters? Oh, it's just a tier 6 wand you get now. He nerfed the wand as well. Damn. Yeah, he does drop Nola, which isn't something I'd imagine you'd want. Except from potentially. I bet this is a very much potentially. How would that work on the, like, death cross spells? that work with Death Cross? Did that just make it explode instantly? I don't know. It's an interesting idea. And here comes all the stuff. It's dropped down. Yeah, random static projectile. We've also got, I believe, random damage. I don't think we want this. And we've got him sitting up there. And no Nola. Instead, I believe we've got this. Um that shall wand, is it any good? Eh, energy shield is alright. Gonna pass on it, it's not something I think I need. Add mana, that is good. At this stage, is it good? I'm not using an expensive wand. This costs like two fifty, maybe three hundred mana. No, that is 300 mana, actually, I worked out earlier, didn't I? Like, that's not expensive, I don't need reduced mana costs. I'm gonna say no. Well, I'm not ditching chat wand, you know how it goes. Got this book as well. Fact, something I need to ask about. Uh, you know the big lake to the far west of everything. I have to take this. This is even worse, Fuke. Yeah, you know the big lakes of far west? There's structures inside of it with portals. I found them a while ago. What do they do? Is that, is that new? I don't remember seeing them before. And should I be going into the portals completely blindly? I think a tablet. And a reforged tablet. What on earth is a reforged tablet? I'll take your word for it, I've got no idea what you do to get a reforged tablet though. Ah, anvil. Alright. Well, I might try that out sometime, maybe not right now. For now, I think I want to be going down. I want to be digging down, or do I want to just go down this ditch? I think I'll go down this ditch. I know I can go under the pyramid, I just want to avoid the pyramid if I can. We've got some dangerous enemies who, if you don't notice them, will just murder you. Yeah, that doesn't seem great, but it's got a lot of these bricks, I might just actually go into the pyramid. Oh, poison trail. Oh god, that came in at a bad time, I was about to start digging. Thankfully I noticed in time to stop, now I just need to wait for it to finish. Like, I can't use the door, that's boring. How could you even imagine me using the door? I mean, I really should. Or the other hole, yeah. 
Or... I mean... That's one way to get through the door, isn't it? <laughs> no, I'm not using it to get through a door, don't you worry. I'm not that much of a maniac. As much as I'd love to just annoy you both, I'm not going to. I mean, understandably so, I'll be honest. Okay, let's burn my way through, there we go. There's fire rat down there, it's not homed in on anything, it should be safe. Okay, it doesn't home in on them apparently. Oh, I almost murdered myself, because apparently it triggered before hitting that. Okay, do I have a secondary wand? I have this. That'll do. <laughs> Is that 45 damage I got? How did I get 45 damage? Oh. Okay, 22 there. Yeah, 20 seems more normal. Oh, we've got Dangerous Man. Uh, I believe the homunculus is random. There is a chance to get a healer out of it. I definitely do need the health. That guy is not a fun one to be dropping on me. He is most certainly not a bush. Oh, gods. Okay. Through there, we've got a few enemies. Fire that. Back off. Should be dead? Yes. I'm not getting the ghost player mod, you're not going to convince me. That's 136 damage out of this one. This is why I love concentrated spells. I mean, if anyone comes back with this one here, that's not gonna be good. Not a good time. I understand that's a function normally in the game, but I'm not doing it. You're not gonna convince me, Fuck. Anyway, we are now in Sand Cave. Oh. Open up Team Viewer? Why, why are you wanting Team Viewer? I'm afraid, what do you want to do? I'm not letting you into my computer. No. I don't trust you. You're gonna try and download some more RAM or something, aren't you? Don't download more RAM for me. I've got enough. I promise. How should those ones die? I want money, so I'm not gonna say no. You're going to mod my game for me. Oh god. That, that would be a mess. I'd be willing to let you mod my game for me though. That sounds like a good kind of mess. Ocean rain, what have we got? Invisibly on. Fungal spore. Big explosion apparently. Pheromone, concentrated mana. Sima. Transformed. What's that? I, I thought it was sand that I heard from when I did fungal shift. I've only done the one fungal shift. Sand wasn't transformed though, we just went through the desert. I'm confused. I'm very confused. I'm not going to question it. Desert sand's its own powder, alright. It seems it's a bit like whiskey. Alright. That would make sense. That is roughly the same colour as whiskey in this game. Fire that down there, it's not homed in, should be safe. Okay, it doesn't get sand shifts. Alright. It's good to know. That I'm not going to- oh god no. 
Okay, run, please. Okay, I managed to avoid the two of them. Somehow they didn't find me. I now have invisibility as well, which definitely serves in my favour. And sadly, not a healer. It's another boring one. Yeah, that must have been just the one guy there. I'm fairly certain it's random. I think I've gotten healers from it before. I might be mistaken, though. I can't say for certain. Oh, no, run, run away from him. I'm invisible, but Fuke Homunculus is not. Okay, that one, I'll be honest, you could have convinced me it was a bush there, an archer. I mean, my eyesight isn't the best. Well done, Fuke. Well done. Ah! This time we did get a healer. Lovely. I see I wasn't lying. I wasn't lying. 2d20. Wait before this goes off. Two different trails. They do seem to actually combine. Interesting. It then ignites itself, I think. A weird combination of trails. I wouldn't have thought of ever doing that. Get yourself explosion and fire immunity. That could actually be a decent weapon. Anyway, I think I've waited long enough. Let's try going down again. All that gunpowder should have opened a very nice trail for us. Continuing to get healed, which is very nice. Yeah, Seema must have been from Sam, because that's just lying around in little pockets in here, isn't it? It's just a giant lake of it. Yeah. Okay, so sand did get transformed into something. Good to know. Oil trail this time. Okay. Okay, oil trail. That's not a great one. Can evaporate the oil. I guess. Let's keep trying to dig. No, that's just fire. That is just fire. Ah, look at Fuke healing himself. How lovely. I can forcibly say no to getting the healing too. I don't know why I do that, but I can. Continue to go down. Okay, we're far enough down. I think it's over to this side we need to go. But if possible, we need to then dig even further down to get to another orb, and that's the orb I haven't yet gotten. So we're up to three orbs. I mean, I think it's a chasm below this, so I'm gonna say yes. I mean, it's better than trying to dig up to it. Oh, and you've dropped a potion, is that up there? It was, but it got turned to cheese. We may never know what it truly was that you dropped for me. Also, I'm starting to think it might not be this way, it might be back in that way. I'm not going to give up on it just yet. Let's keep on trying. Anything through here? Can't hear any orb noises. And you've just come to the wall. It was in the other direction. Also, we lost one of the fukes. I think we have. And this one's not wanting to heal me, so may have lost the healer. I don't know. Don't know. 
I mean, we've got half health. That's fine. I say no to half health. More than enough to lose all in one go. I don't, I don't like going into the darkness. I'm just gonna fire my wand off occasionally. Oh, never mind. We've just got to war broom. Have a theory about them, do you? Stainless armor. Just 50% less damage. I swear that never used to be less damage. That used to just be a different one. Or no, I'm thinking of repelling cloak, haven't I? Yeah, no, never mind. Repelling cloak's one which stops you getting stains. Stainless armor. I don't know if they did change it. Might have still. It's hard to say. They stack it and take gas blood. Do you mean slime blood? Slime blood was strike me as a more like important thing. Yeah, why gas blood? That that's an odd one. Ah, because gas doesn't stain. Alright. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. And anyway, we've got this thing now. And I believe I just need to go straight down. Is there a cursed rock down here? I don't think there is. They've given me hunting dogs. Let's just murder them briefly. Oh! This guy's wanting to heal me again. There's no more orbs down. But there's no more orbs down here? You're saying? Or are you saying there's no more hunting dogs? The orb is down. No orb below here. You sure? I swear if you go far enough down, like to the right of where the, is it the anvil roughly, it's a big empty space, I think there's an orb down there. Am I mistaken? I might be mistaken. Like, I swear on the Noita map I've looked at before. Give me a second, I'm gonna get up my Noita map I usually look at. There's a Noita map. Yeah, it's way, way down. Like, you need to go under the tower. Like, it's down by the entrance to hell, but below here... And yeah, below here directly is a tower. I need to be going off to the side then down. Yeah, that's fine. Go this way then. I could do a tower. I'm not digging into it though. It's cursed rock and it's treated the same as the stuff in the like parallel worlds walls. So I will die if I try and get through there. I've not got enough health just the moment. If I dig down at the edge of this, I should be safe to assume I'm not going to bump into the tower. But let's go on a dig. Now take a moment, apparently there's recoil to plasma. Oh, there goes the healing thing. I'm sorry. Uh, no, this isn't Ambrosia, this is, I believe, worm blood, yeah. I can see stuff, but I'm not going to stop myself from dying. I'll oh, scatter gold. Okay, that's actually alright. There's only so many places it could be scattered to. That, that's not too bad. It's fine, actually. I think I've gotten stuck in terrain. No, let me get my gold. There we go. Yeah, I feel bad accidentally murdering that homunculus. All it wanted to do was keep me alive. Okay, my 
drink that one blood just to see how far off I am. How far down to dig? Christ. Okay. Oh no, not healing taxes. Healing shouldn't cost anything. I'm not in the US. This is Noita. Noita's... I don't know where. Noita was set in the country. What country do you think it would be? I mean, I genuinely have no idea. But where are fungal caverns? You'd think it'd be in Finland, would you? I mean, just because of language, or is there any other reason? Oh, and you've given me healing ghosts. Lovely. I can now survive a bit longer. Let's keep making my way down. I found a good angle. Majority of the terrain. Which part? Do you mean the desert with the pyramid in it? <laughs> Minus the desert. Oh, yeah, fair enough. You had the same exact thought as me immediately. Yeah, it could be somewhat Nordic scenarios, yeah. Like big lakes, you got snowy mountains. Like, it'd be around that area, I'd imagine. Like, Finland has deserts, does it? Well, I learnt something new today. I mean, I've never been good with geography, but I don't think Finland would have deserts. Hmm. That's interesting. I thought it would be the right kind of place for deserts. Like, I understand deserts don't mean necessarily sand. It could make a lot more sense if you keep that in. Oh god, no. Oh god, no. Oh god, no. What have you done? No. 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 I'm still alive. How on earth am I still alive? What on earth? I'm just stuck now. Okay. Well. That earthquake didn't go too badly, I mean. The locals call them... I'm not even going to try and pronounce that, but... That's very interesting. I did not think there'd be deserts around there. Do they have, like, any cultural significance behind them? Like, is that something people maybe thought of as a religious thing? Because they're just, like, tiny deserts. Also, there's a potion there, so I must be going in the right direction. I think this is fungal caverns I'm digging into. In English, it's sand pits. Alright. Maybe not a cultural thing there, if you're calling it a sand pit. You can't tempt me like this. You can't. I mean, I want to, but no. I can't. Is this the entire fungal biome I've just found? I knew there was a new biome entirely about fungal stuff. An overgrown cavern. Okay. This does seem bad, you're not wrong. I kinda want to eat some fungus. Eating fungus couldn't possibly be a bad thing. Yeah, this area does not seem good. I I'm not gonna be staying here for long. Uh, digging blast is an alright wand, I'm gonna say no. Go down into power plant. Gosset. We've got enemies that spit out pollen. Got extra health. Various things exploding into acid. Got new mushroom. Never seen that big tall guy before. Oh, 
look at all the weird fungus I can get insanely high and trip out. Lovely. What's going to fungal shift next, and should I be afraid? The answer is yes, I should. Diamond. I just transformed weird fungus into diamond. Okay, no more fungal shifts for me then. Also, what's this one? Necromancy. A wand modifier I've always liked the idea of. I've never found a good use for it. Also, that area terrifies me. Luckily, I'm good at taking out groups of enemies, but that terrifies me, having all those little ones. What have we got this time? Light shot. Faster projectile, but lower damage. Yeah, I'm gonna say no. This one, yeah, nothing all that great. There's all ones around here. None of them are particularly great, they all seem to be around the same quality as Fungal Caverns, which would make sense. Oh, I found desert -y stuff. desert -y stuff, is that what I want to be going into? i say it's good for early game shift, but... I mean, is it? It's a bit of a dangerous area for early game, surely. That's one I don't like homing normally. That almost killed me just there. Luckily it went past me quick enough to not. But, oh god, that was not a fun time. How did I get into this? There we go. Ooh, and that's that little house. I can still trip. Can I? How? How, how do you trip? Do you need to eat fungal blood maybe? Fungal blood's a thing that exists. Flask of toxic sludge. Just like inhale the fumes, do you? I mean, that would somewhat make sense. Oh yeah, yeah right. I could transform various things into fungus still. Anyway, you said go down. I am heading down. Is this the right down, or am I going the wrong down? I'd imagine there's only the one down. Down under cavern. Got it. Well, I'll keep going down then, because I've never been to the power plant, and I'm curious. Let's see. Oh, that guy's not fun. We have a block of ducks. I want to, but no, I can't. Spatial awareness. So there's a special perk down there then. Got it. I'll definitely want to be grabbing that then, at least for progress. Oh, and Moon Radar's been moved here. Is there anything in the Lucky Caverns now? Dark Flame, I have to pass it up. I don't need Dark Flame, I'm doing well enough. Alright, so Lucky Caverns I might want to put my head into at some point. What would be there then? might have existed elsewhere before. I'm not sure. I'm assuming I'm still going in the correct direction. It's there. Or like, up there? I mean, I'm not... I'm not good at figuring stuff out. Go down. Still? Really? I've gone very far down at this point. I don't even know where I am. I 
music's a bit funky, which is nice. Yeah, I'm, I'm not sure if it is down or not. I'll trust you on it. I'm not seeing anything, though. I was just waiting for that. Oh, that's great. Maybe gone too far left. Or right. I've, I've entered something. What have I entered? Earth. Nullifying altar. The perk remover. Alright. So I shouldn't immediately jump into it. Got it. I'm gonna not jump into it. Three different materials of like specific kinds, or can I just use anything? Because there's fire in that one, there's poison in this one. If I just like add anything, like that fire is not ever going out seemingly. Does Sima just burn forever? Ah, things are alchemic symbols. Got it. That's never going to be something I'd figure out on my own. I'm gonna be honest. I don't know my chemical symbols off the top of my head. We do have invisible guys now, though. So I think we're heading in the right direction. As soon as people start turning invisible, it makes me think I'm going in the right way. I'm very far down at this point. Do I want to keep going down? I mean, to get the orb, yes. But beyond that, I don't think so. Oh? What's this? Power plant, I've found it! Duke, I've done it! I've found where you wanted me to go. That guy doesn't die to my weapon, oh no. Um. Why doesn't he die? What'd I do? Um. Um. It's my only real weapon, I'm gonna be honest. <laughs> I've only got my plasma. Apart from that, it's splitter bolts. Which also don't seem to do anything. <laughs> uh, energy orb. That's not gonna work either, is it? Yeah. Um. Let's run. Let's just run. <laughs> oh no. Um, plasma cutter cuts through most materials, doesn't cut through them. Got it. Um, chaotic polymorphine, I can change him into something I'm allowed to murder. Oh god. Um, yeah, I, I don't. I don't care about them being invisible at the moment, I just want to survive. Just die, you robot Get. Can't believe you. Luckily I have this repulsion sector, that is keeping me alive. Yeah, I need to get a different wand, seemingly. I wasn't aware plasma immunity was a thing that creatures would have. Do I just want to be running from everything in here, or certain things? Everything, it seems. Okay. Um, yeah, I'm just... I'm not going to do power plant, I've decided. Yeah, I'm... I'm going. I mean, the only kind of damage I have is energy. If that's the kind you'd call it. Polymorph creatures, okay. How far did things polymorph? Not far enough. That thing's just an invisible robot. There were ones up the way, weren't there? In the fungal caverns. I go up to the fungal caverns. 
how do I survive? Okay, no, that thing just attacks me as well. I'm aware you're invisible. I can't murder you though. Stay away. Uh, physics objects. Physics objects could do it. Okay, that, that didn't work. Okay, let, let's try it again. <laughs> I'm gonna try physics objects to death. Very least, he's no longer completely invisible. Not that I wasn't able to see him regardless because of the whole polymorph thing. Yeah, I've got electric arc. That would work. The only thing is, I don't have anywhere to go edit my wands. So it's just physics damage I have to rely on, it would seem. That, that did not do its job. Mighty Duck it could have a wand in its chest. Okay, that, that guy's a bit dangerous. Got a big laser beam. That might be a bit excessive to kill one guy, though. Oh, this projectile's knocked my thing. He does hit through my repulsion sector. Oh, God. Okay. Oh no, this is horrible. Why did I go down here, Fuke? You shouldn't have told me to. Okay, I've got an idea. Can I kick this? Will it just explode? Yeah, that orb's gonna be a tough one. Oh, I need to run away. Kicking them would, would do stuff. I, I don't... I don't know. The fact I can get through my repulsion sector makes me think I don't want to be moving towards it at all. I get so many plasma cutters if I need. Like, look at that. Just eviscerated things. Is that lively concoction potions? Brilliant. <laughs> eh? Goodbye, chaotic polymorphine. A little lively concoction. <laughs> okay, I might be able to just tank them now. Tanking them is possible. <laughs> this is hardly what I expected to be doing. Oh god, what were the chances? Can I take care of that turret thing at least? No, none of these things can be murdered. Brilliant. Okay. Okay, uh, there's no immediate way down, is there? I've already been marked, so they can all just fire at me. His shields could protect me if I stayed with him. We'll feel right then down. Oh, there's a wand. There's also a big scary enemy. I can murder that one. Okay, I can murder big scary enemy. I can murder him. That's fine. Okay. Oh, for the love of God. That's dormant crystal. Okay, we need to go find the other wand then. We need to go get that wand from above. Okay. That invisible one is going to be staying on top of the turret. That's to my advantage. Acid ball! No! Go away! I don't want acid ball! Okay, now that, that's annoying, that one. Um, um, I mean, I have to, don't I? <laughs> what? Has anyone ever seen this before? Because I was not aware this was something you could do. <laughs> I can murder giant worms. That's fine. <laughs> oh god, no, 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 no. I'm, I'm wrong. Lively concoction, heal me please. 
Uh, enemy in there, I can wonder, I believe. No, nope, that's a different one. Okay, we've got another one. Another one. Uh, TNT explosions could work. Explosions could. I'm just running. I'm running. Oh god, I'm running. I like up for his larpa. That's a fun one. You're managing to escape. You're trying to murder me still, which I feel is a bit uncalled for. I'm doing my hardest to just stay alive. I'm just. I'm gonna keep on going. Polymorphine! Okay, polymorphine, that helped a bit. That did help. Go away, you invisible guy. I killed myself, apparently. Extra life did not save me, I feel lied to. Yeah, plasma beams are dangerous. They are as big a threat to me than anything else. I'm surprised I lasted so long in there. That was good. That was good. Yeah, that's last run of the day. There's no point. I've got 10 minutes left. I'm planning to stream for. Nah, I don't need to do any more for today. Yeah, that was good. I'm happy that went well. Four new things, apparently. Worm launcher. I've apparently never taken stainless armor. Yeah, these two were new. There's a fair few new enemies. The manager are going to be appearing in these slots. Possibly one in that slot, maybe another one there, just from the power plant. Yeah, enemy wise, I've gotten most of it at this point. Still don't know what most of the ones down here would be. Not certain. I have, however, murdered the Santa with dynamite before, which, that was a fun one. I think that was around for a week, around Christmas. Yeah, it's just going to be a few bosses and, yeah, various enemies. Still need a lot of spells though. Like, there's a lot I need to find. Like, I'm at 67.5. That's fine. And yeah, there's one orb spell as well, which I haven't gotten yet. But yeah, that was a good run to do. I'm glad that went well. Yeah, I hope you all enjoyed it too. I do hope you enjoy the rest of your evening or day or whatever it is for you. And I'll hopefully see you next time. Bye for now.